Now, before I get into this episode, there is a brief bit of history, if you can call it history, that you guys should know about. In AD 2101, war was beginning. themselves to only be about nine years behind the curve, Marvelous Entertainment blatantly and unashamedly brings up the long gone all your base meme. I'm gonna give them a pass for this, like I genuinely have not heard about all your base in a long time. So it's not like they're trying to jump on the bandwagon of a joke that's just during its decline in popularity. Regardless, Cats is trying to end the world, so Hero, as usual, sets out to stop him. Now, earlier, the food vendor in the first town said he had something to tell us once the time was right, so let's go ahead and check that out. Well, dealing with weirdos has kind of been our job lately, so I guess it's up to us to see what's going on. Alright, honestly, this puzzle is sort of confusing if you're not paying a whole lot of attention. These trees that they just zoomed down to are supposed to represent a controller, and those monuments above them tell you the code you're supposed to input on these so-called buttons. I'm not going to read the monuments because I know what the code is. I'm just going to go right ahead and put it in. Please note that if you so much as press one button wrong, you have to start the whole thing over, but it's such a time sink that at that point it's safer to just reset the clock. Well, with nothing left for us to do on this map, let's just head right on over to Cats.
Alright, I remember the last time you suggested we jump straight into action, and I'm honestly having none of that. Well, looks like we have to go through this whole map with only one herb. This is actually a little rough for me, as I do usually burn through herbs like they're candy. This kid seems familiar to me, but I can't quite place my finger on it. Ah, well, I'm sure it's not important. These guys have food to sell down here, but it is outrageously expensive, with no benefit to it other than healing you to full health. Needless to say, I won't be buying any of it. The only place left for us to explore is this cave. It's usually a safe bet to grind a bit, then reset the clock before you venture into unknown territory. Oh, who's this asshole? Since the currents are normalized, the town is instantly restocked with food. I'm not entirely sure how they managed to go fishing for food so fast, but I'm not complaining. Alright, good news, bad news. Good news is, there is a new shield here for us. Bad news is, it is super expensive and the only way to earn that money is through grinding. I just went ahead and cut that out due to how incredibly repetitive it is, but you'll notice that now I'm level 25. I'll just let that sink in for a bit. Okay, but what if we never fix the current? Surely we'd go to a different path on the map, right? 